This is Michael Johnson with Pro Player Insiders. We are here with Marnie at her G- Blue Jeans Bar Store here in New Orleans, and we are interviewing her for Mardi Gras slash Super Bowl. How are you doing today? Doing great. Awesome, awesome. So how does your store actually work? So our store works um, in a really great way. Mm-hmm. When people, like for me, when I, before I started working here, I always had a lot of trouble finding a pair of jeans. So okay. I never knew really what I needed or what to look for. Okay. Um, kind of like trying on a bathing suit. It's always hard getting a bathing suit. <laughs> well, we work in a really great way here as far as when someone walks in, we ask them if they've ever shopped at the Blues Jean Bar before. If they say no, then we ask them um, what their style is, what their wash is, and what their waist size is. And then we pull the jeans for you um, from behind our bar. Um, your jean tender, kind of like a bartender. And nice. we do all the work and pulling the jeans. We have about 25 brands for women and about 10 brands for men. And we really take the time to fit them in that perfect pair of jeans that they're looking for. Awesome. How how um how long has your store been in existence or this store here has been here um for about a year. Okay. But the company actually started in uh San Francisco in two thousand four. Okay. The owner, Lady Fuller, um, she went to college actually in San Francisco graduate school and the whole concept of the Blues Jean Bar was her senior thesis paper. Ooh. After college she um, you know, made it a reality and opened the first store there and now um, we have about eighteen stores and okay. our latest are just opened up in Greenwich, Connecticut. Wow, okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, since it's, you know, Super Bowl s- season and then Mardi Gras is right around the corner, mm-hmm. do you feel like you're going to get a lot of um, traffic? Yes. Uh, we've already started to see it a little bit, and I know, um, you know, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, especially yes. Sunday, I mean, you never know. People could be coming in, like, earlier, and then, but I figure most people are going to be downtown. But all the visitors, um, I'm sure they're going to be coming down a magazine because I know like a lot of the concierge are going to be like, it's a great shopping destination. We dropped off some gift cards to all the concierge. Awesome. So we're expecting awesome. a big turnout. I know you're sponsoring our venue, our venue um, Pro Player Insiders, and you're donating a gift bag and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. I mean, is this like giving back? Yeah. Um, we're going to... Well, we hope it helps to give back. Um, we're donating a <laughs> okay. $100 gift card um, to... A shopping event here at the store um, and I'm sure we could work something out because um, I know there's gonna be tons of people coming in from out of town if right. they aren't um, you know don't live in New Orleans maybe we could because um, we have so many other stores if they live near another store we could work something out or do something but um, it's a great thing because obviously people you know for silent auctions they're gonna you know shell out mm-hmm. a lot of money and right. it's really to benefit it's, it they want to get the item but also they know they're benefiting um, the charity yes so um, yeah Keeping our fingers crossed that awesome. someone donates on it. We definitely appreciate you know you sponsoring you know our event. Mm-hmm. So thank you Anytime. so much. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.